If someone would have told me a couple of weeks ago that we'd still be chasing a diamond jackrabbit and that's it for Rancho Del Arroyo, I wouldn't have believed him. <laughs> we had the two in early access so easily, and I can't tell you how many I've shot out here, single player and multiplayer, just a bunch of golds and stuff like that, but we're going to continue today, and we're going to spend time in pheasant territory as well, and I actually want to run up this road and go around. I know rabbits are like near this lake, so maybe going the, on this side instead of the normal way is going to produce something. Good thinking, by the way, on that, Kyla. I completely forgot the uh, pinned comment. So actually, you're the best. What's up, Haxter? Playing this game right now? Nice, man. Hopefully you can have some decent luck out here. Are we playing multiplayer or just in single player today? We're probably going to do, I'm going to say, Friday stream, assuming we do come back here to Rancho, which we probably will. If we don't have a Diamond Jack Rabbit by then, which I really hope we do, uh, we're probably going to do some Rancho multiplayer then. I think it might be Rancho multiplayer anyway. We'll kind of have to see, but yeah, single player for now. What's up, corpse? Did you have any luck with your stream uh, yesterday? I... I got to see like two minutes as I said I was running off uh, right at the end there. Should just make a console release date. I should make the, the release date? Is that what you're saying? You know, um, actually, maybe this will be useful information uh, to some that m maybe don't know this is kind of how it works. There is a certification process that games and updates have to go through with consoles. And the reason I think that we rarely get like a super specific date for console release is they don't know if they're going to pass certification until they do and when they do they can make it go live so a lot of times we see you know like release sometime in july and then all of a sudden you know on their twitter it's out now like we usually don't even know what it is i think that's kind of why uh savage thanks for renewing your membership by the way i think that's the one that came up right my alerts are so odd with streamlabs i never know what's going on that was a bunny track, so I'm glad to know they are here. Small little male. We might as well run with the shotgun out. Not much point. Binoculars when we're looking for rabbits, we're more likely to spook them and need to shoot than anything. Shot two diamond white tail, but neither were rare. I hope you get one. I actually, you know, I don't even know what to think about this. We have the albino diamond white tail, and they've changed the, like, uh, the model for albinos now. Or not the model, the, the texture. It's going to change in the lodge, too, and it's weird. Like, it looks better to me, but it looks... It was different when I shot it, you know? It's just an odd thing for me. Like, I know it's going to change. How do I feel about that? Anyway, what's up, Rebecca? Diamond bunny or bad? I I hope so, dude. I really want to get it. I've shot here. I'll, I'll open my uh, latest harvest again. Just bunnies, turkeys, pheasants, a couple of peccary. I just keep shooting stuff for respawns and open for the best. It's, it's not big enough, Rebecca. We need pin messages to be... You know, I ought to just put it, like, across the screen, but I did that... I've done that on a couple of streams, and the thing is, when I do, like... Hello there. That's a decent buck. We're not going to get a shot off in time, though. Well, I tried. <laughs> anyway, um... When I make, like, highlight videos, I don't record, like, at the time. I go back and record the screen from the stream itself. So then, you know, there's text on the in the video. I don't know. Small perfectionist things. Maybe I should put it there. What's up, TTV? Sorry, I'm late to reply. Great, great one grinding right now. Nice, Billy. Have you had any luck today? You know, I'm kind of... only because he got away. <laughs> Determined to try to get him. That was a bit far back and high. Not the best shooting so far. Thank you for making that much easier. I appreciate you, man. My best is two gold pronghorn, not very good. I mean, it takes some time to, you know, get some trophies under your belt, but the more you play, the more you'll start to encounter. Where is that at? It made it... Sometimes the location of those indicators is not super accurate. It made it seem like it was going to be up on the hill, but I certainly couldn't see it. What gun should I use for small game? If you have the weapon pack 1 DLC, grab the... Uh, 22 rifle. If you don't, also there's a ton of something in here. Um, 12 gauge shot gonna work with bird shot if you had the bird shot unlocked. The I'm trying to think, like base game weapons. I think it's only 12 gauges for base game weapons. It depends on what DLCs you have, to be honest. What 
that's up, Lucky. Managed to save our gold boyo there. Out of my four rares, only one is a male, and it's a level one loss to the render glitch. Are you... I know some people have started to shoot does more and more, especially to, like, do certain things with zones. Are you shooting the females, or did you just have a bunch of rare ones hanging around your map? Rude of it, Lucky. Just got my first real diamond yesterday. Uh, started hunting bighorn and got a diamond turkey. Nice, dude. We're one turkey away from completing the uh, collection, by the way, I guess, of common plumage types, so wouldn't mind getting that done at some point. I take it, well, <laughs> bighorn and turkey are on two maps together. So could be rancho, could be SRP. I'm curious which, which uh, turkey species that was. What's up, Rack? Palos in here apparently reading the pinned comments of people who don't like to fill the same, uh, fill the chat with the same question over and over. I feel like maybe it's just dismissed as, because you can dismiss it, right? Maybe it's expected it has nothing to do with the stream, I don't know. What's up, bottom boy? Did you see the thing in Discord that you got tagged into my server, by the way? I'm just curious. I was proud of it. I have a great idea for Call of the Wild content. It's called the Call of the Wild All-Nighter. You stay up all night, seeing what you can get. If anyone wants to use it, go ahead. I don't make vids anyway. You know, that's essentially um, what yesterday's video was, although I didn't kill anything. I'm, I'd like to know if I wasn't tired and trying to get that video done, would it have actually gotten done more quickly? Because I think I started switching servers too quick and looking for you know, the easily accessible spots, looking for stuff. There were so many hours where I just got nothing. It was terrible. But, um, I've done videos similar to that. I don't know if I could even tell you what they're called. But there were, I think, last summer or the summer before, a number of videos where it was just, like, the highlights of staying up all night playing Call of the Wild. Didn't really name it that, but pretty similar concept. Where are those bunnies at? That's why I titled it Show Me the Bunny. I was hoping it would help us out. By the way, Billy, I'm going to do that Settlers video soon. Um, maybe for next week. I, I had too much stuff going on yesterday to do like my first Settlers hunt, but I intend on doing the week on Settlers very soon. As expected for console, never it'll get there. I'm sure they had some kind of pretty major issue. I, oh, I heard it. Where you at? That's a deer. There you are. Guess we'll take the one female bunny. There's a zone down there, so there might be more. Anyway, I I saw a lot of people saying like they'd rather bugged Rancho than no Rancho, and I just want to point out that they can't release bugged Rancho at least to a certain degree because it has to pass certification, and Sony and Microsoft do that, not uh, you know the the devs themselves. Why are they taking so long? I think I just, uh, hopefully somewhat, uh, in simple terms, explained that. <laughs> Lovely, Lucky. Um, Coach, thank you for the super chat, by the way. Flintlock, <laughs> glad to be back at the sea, man. My favorite map is still Leighton Lakes. Uh, mine is as well, actually. You know, um, Scarecrow just did a video, if you guys haven't seen it. Whitetail drink time has been changed on Leighton, which is a bizarre thing. Like, they've never changed old map um, zone times. Layton's been out for four and a half years. Whitetail been drinking 12 to 1500, but it's 12 to 1600 now. I think some blacktail times got changed. It's interesting they redid that. Um, but what that says to me is that they're willing to potentially make some maps better with the zone times. I think Archfelden's another one that could maybe use some shifting around of, of those kinds of things, but... Yeah, I'm, I'm excited to get back on Layton. I intend to do some goose hunting here soon. Um, Kyla has a fellow guide for you guys that's going to be on this channel probably... It's within a week, I'm not sure exactly when. I'm going to get that all edited. But, yeah. A exploration of Layton and the new zones is something I'm really excited to do. What's up, Silver? If you genuinely get zero trophies on Settlers, then I'll be okay with you hating it. I think I'd have a hard time ending up with zero. Um... 
the thing is, if I... I don't have a video then, <laughs> because... Unless I guess I'm recording subpar stuff, because my goal is not to record all... What is that? Two hours for seven different hunts, all 14 hours? I just want to, like... You know, a 340 plus elk shows up, press record. A big turkey shows up, press record. Stuff like that. Uh, if there's nothing, I guess I'm going to have to change my idea for such things. New mic? Nah, it's still the same. Um, you know, I noticed in two videos ago, three videos ago, something sounded different. There was a Windows update, and I'm not sure if it updated my mic settings here. Let me, um, uh, there's one thing that I think it could be. Uh, if I click the right thing. Sound settings. Oh. Yeah, something's different. I'm not sure what. I'm pretty sure this might mess with things. Hopefully it doesn't. Eh. Do I have to confirm this? I don't think. Uh, was it too bassy or too loud? It, the... Not the gain. There's like a percentage that your mic is set to, and it was set to 100. It should have been 95. If this sounds any different, let me know, because I think I changed it back. Hope you're ready to hit record a lot then. Where'd that go? Because Settlers is just chock full of those big male trophies. Oh yeah, we see that every time I stream it. There's monsters just crawling out of every nook and cranny on that map. How much shotgun score and how much cash is the 16 gauge? I don't know that shotgun score is required. There's a male rabbit down there somewhere. Not much point trying to sneak up on him. Um, there's a good chance we simply won't see it anyway. But, uh, yeah, I, I don't think there's a weapon score requirement. It's 45,000 cash, if I'm not mistaken. Is this our bunny zone here? I hope so. I would feel much better if we kill one male rabbit on this little run up above the lake, and we're almost done with it, so... Uh, that would be quite a relief if we could see one. That's a female track. It's also not the right zone, I don't think. That's, that's an older zone. Um, is that pronounced Poe? I hope so. Thanks for renewing your channel membership as well. I appreciate you. More rain. Depressing indeed. It absolutely poured here yesterday when I was driving home from uh, taking a look at that house. It just... I couldn't even see. It was crazy. Very old tracks. I don't know where they went. I just... Oh, I found a couple of them. Female. Don't know what that was, but it's dead. They do this, and they're so tiny. Somehow, despite their huge ears, that they actually hide pretty well. And then they just sit there and never move to your right on top of them, so you don't see them. Uh, shot basically the tiniest female possible, and then a little male in there. Good to know the zone exists. I figured they'd be chilling here. I think I saw the other one up there to the north. I'm not 100% certain on that. There's a place I want to go. Uh, that I seem to recall spotting a number of rabbits and rabbit tracks. And I want to go there probably soon. I'm not 100% like, uh certain on their zone times and stuff just yet, but it seems like until 7, they're a little more active, so I want to grab this. David, thanks for renewing your membership as well. I see that gold gun badge, so despite the fact that Streamlabs is telling me it's a brand new one, I know that's been one for quite some time. Welcome back, man. Thank you. All right, we're going to hop down here and go back towards this lake. We are going to see probably some bighorn as well, maybe some other things. Nice, Angry. You should make a video after the stream of the highlights stream. Wait, what now? Oh, I got you. Yeah, I used to... There was a time when I was doing, like, highlights of pretty much every stream. I probably could do that again. I don't know. Here's, <laughs> here's the issue for me personally. I like to try to do as much unique content as possible. And it is sort of reusing content. Unless... Maybe I could post it, like, on Fridays, since we do a Twitch stream anyway. That could be a potential option. I'll look into doing something like that. Coach, thank you again, by the way. 
I love the, if you could plug it, the IRL turkey hunts. Good job, thank you, man. If you could plug it. What am I missing there? The meat hunters? Is that what I'm getting there? I'm not 100% sure. Speaking of um, plugging things, though. We plugged it a little bit in yesterday's video, but we have the new merch with the hats. I'm pretty sure that's the next one that comes up there. Yeah. I like them. I think they're cool. I'm really looking forward to hunting one of them this year. Uh, a picture behind a deer with a 12 hat. What a dream. Could do one highlight vid from all the week's streams. If I did it on Friday, I could use the previous Friday's stream to do that. Wait. Watch it. Uh, because uh, there's like a exclusivity period with Twitch streams. So for instance, like if I stream on a Friday and end at 3 p.m., I can't upload anything until 3 p.m. Saturday. But yeah, that might be a way to go about that. Oh. I wonder how I got up there. I don't remember what path I took to get in here. I just know, I think in multiplayer, I saw a bunch of rabbit tracks. I wanted to give this a shot. There's one right there. No, there's not. That's a coyote. Never mind. This one. No. Maybe there's no rabbits. Who knows? Rat getting neglected as usual. I can't see him well. I, I'm used to mod and sub badge and stuff on Twitch. I see his name anyway. Twelve hats yeah. are epic. Well, thank you, man. I saw Bottom Boy saying as well, if you uh, buy something, leave a review. It does definitely help out. Coast, thank you again. Meat Hunters, check them out. Thank you, dude. Sorry for uh, my inability to be certain on what you're saying, but yeah, if you haven't checked that out, I think Kyla had the link in the chat there a moment ago, but it's it's really cool. There's uh, myself, TK, and my brother. We do our IRL hunting videos over on that channel. And I quite enjoy it. I'm looking forward to some of the stuff we have coming this summer and then, of course, this coming fall. It better be a 12 square foot house or bad. There's 12s involved. Uh, not, not 12 square foot because I would like to fit in it, but 12s are involved, I promise. Not sure... I mean, I guess getting a house, hopefully, Peter. Um, a house of some kind, but... We'll have to see what happens with this one. Obviously, I can't be certain, but I'm optimistic. I hear... I don't know if it's coyotes or what, but I can hear footsteps. You think I has monies? I wasn't trying to, like, entice you to become a member here. I was just saying sometimes I don't see names as well. See, what catches my eye, and like, it's colors, and sometimes that's profile pictures, by the way, and not just... Like, name color. So, I'm used to, when I look for Rack, seeing a certain thing on Twitch. <laughs> Tis all it is. Um, Eric, thank you for the super chat, by the way. What's the significance of 12? Alright, so to kind of tell the story... Uh... Should I say the name? I guess it doesn't matter. Um, all the above. He is my... I believe he's still my youngest moderator on Discord, but a couple of years ago, he was definitely my youngest moderator on Discord, and sort of as a joke, we would say, like, he's 12, because the Discord TOS requirement is 13. So, just like a year young joke, that's all it was. And it just turned into this massive meme, and at this point, any number-related question is just answered with 12. It's, it's just sort of a community thing that's grown out of something that I would have never expected, but... I kind of like it. I don't know why. Exactly, Kyla. The digits of the address do add up to 12. So it's got to be it. Speaking of PFP, I need to change mine on here. What is yours? I recognize it. I believe it was your Discord PFP at some point, but I can't remember. Got my medals on Twitch to make me special. Exactly. See, now I can see you. I know what I'm looking for. What's in your loadout? Currently, we are running with the 16 gauge, 303, 243, and 22. By the way, I don't know why I don't have those equipped. Uh. Rack is younger, though? Oh, true. No longer the youngest mod. Is he younger? 
it's similar. Yeah, I guess it would be. Uh, the next max, thank you for the super chat, by the way. Appreciate you. To be honest, all the above still 16 in my mind. I have a hard time remembering the fact that he's aged at all, so don't mind me. Jacob needs answers on the Great One grind? Wait, what is the question? Hmm. There's a severe lack of bunnies compared to what I thought we'd see. There's this zone down here for rabbits. Let's go wander down that way. Hi. Quick question, do you need to buy a certain weapon pack to get the M1? If so, what weapon pack? By the way, love your content. Well, thank you, man. The Smoke and Barrels weapon pack is the most recently released one. It's been like a year now. But, uh, yeah. I believe it's not called Weapon Pack 4, it's called the Smoke and Barrels Weapon Pack. Who's the oldest mod? Discord mod or what? I don't know. Beagle? Is he? I don't think about those kinds of things very often, so I'm, I'm not even certain. Rack is just a small lad. A small Floridian. Show me the bunny at this point. Show him any bunny. Any will do. Just just ears and something that hops. I'll believe it. We'll take it. Streams mod? There's a lot more stream mods. See, there's some that aren't active as well. Like it... It's... I think Rek and Riki are still mods, so it might be one of them. Beard is technically still a mod. It depends on what you consider a mod. It's, it wouldn't be you, though. What have I missed? Just got on a lot of running and looking. I I sort of was planning today to try something, and I think we're going to have to do it. I've had the best luck. Actually, I said in, I think it was um last Friday's stream, I said that I thought rabbit hunting was best at night. It seems like evening, like 1700 to 1900, right before it gets dark. That time frame is when I'm seeing the most rabbits. So we're probably going to go and hunt pheasants for like 10-15 minutes and then we'll switch the evening and go after these little jumper boyos because this just simply isn't working. What's up, Cutie Hunter? How's it going, man? thought I saw tracks, not the tracks I wanted. You know where we should go? Is the southeast. That's another one of the hidden outposts. So, uh, the interesting thing about Rancho is not every outpost on the map is marked. Nah. You can see that nothing here. Nothing at all. But there, there's an outpost out there, and what's annoying is I ran right past it because I've been here. You can see I have this zone unlocked. I just saw a gobbler who might give us a shot with a shotgun, really. There's a couple more flying around, but, uh, that'll do. This trap is over there. Go figure. Um, Kason, thank you for the super chat, by the way. Turning 12 backwards today, I love the content. Well, thank you so much, man. I appreciate you. All the 12 today, I like it. I got a deal for you. I smoke a 110 plus Sitka on your map Wednesday. I get Twitch mod, I think it's a fair deal. I've made a... What was that? It was for, um... Why well, can't I think? I only know his real name now. It was for one of the regular viewers on Twitch. I think it was over a football game. It might have been the Super Bowl or something. Like, if a certain team won, he was going to get to become a VIP and he now is one over there. I will have to think about such things. Hidden outpost? Yeah, so anyway, to go back on that, there's a number of outposts scattered around this map that are hidden. One is... Here? No, here. It's odd that they, they don't mark them, like there's nothing, you just have to go and find them. It's kind of cool, I like the idea, I hope they do it more, but that might actually explain the fast travel issue. Those of you unaware, you can't fast travel to this outpost. If you try, it spawns you here. Uh, it Maybe it's because they've added so many outposts, their like, spawn points are tangled up somewhere. I'm guessing that's what's going on. What's up, Roll? I live in PA, we had lots of rain yesterday. It rained pretty good yesterday. I'm actually kind of pleased to have this spot. If there are more rabbits in here than we saw just now, multiplayer, this could be a good one to spawn in. I do think it's going to become less and less valuable, like naturally. 
But I do think having those hidden outposts in multiplayer could be really, really useful early on. No mods or VIP on Flinter's Twitch. I think there's two VIPs. I think that's it. I might be wrong, there might be one. Rack is one? Maybe there's three then. I don't know. Not VIPs, so you're officially hated? I see how it is. I was the one VIP that became mod. Is Rack saying he's a VIP though? I don't even know who is a VIP. I don't even use that. Can you customize the VIP badge? Because I'd be more likely to use it if it wasn't like a weird looking pink diamond. Where? I saw something. I don't know what. Unless Rocky ran in front of us and it said bees interact. No, there's a coyote in there. Anyway, I wanted to go up to the lookout here and just kind of scan around. I've had some good luck with rabbits here in multiplayer, but my map doesn't seem to do that well. I didn't even know it goes away lucky. There's some rabbit tracks. Just some small fellas. I wonder why they keep on flying at us. If only they would do that more often. That'll do. Got like 29 months subbed on there, so I got the Founder's Badge. That I know you have. I need to seriously figure out like a two and a half year badge. I don't know what to do. Someone more creative than I, maybe. Ow. Are you gonna do an IRL duck hunt? There's, I know someone that does it a good bit, so if I can, you know, get to join them sometime, there's a chance. I think that would be tough to film. You'd almost have to have like a full-time cameraman for such a thing. Self-filming it, you'd need like multiple angles running at all times to really have a decent video. We'll see. Might be in the customized thingy. They've started like allowing more customizations off to look. Is that pronounced Kaylee? I hope so. Thank you for the super chat. Uh, good luck on the hunt. I managed to get my first diamond whitetail on this map yesterday. Nice. This map has been pretty kind of people for whitetail. Curious if you uh, know the answer. Was it the... Or which rack was it? There's three different diamond whitetail racks. There's like the smallest one that's kind of like wiry. There's the middle one that's got a pretty unique frame. Then like the biggest one that would be like 268 plus. Self film, archery, elk, or bad? Um... Take me to a place where I can do it. Some bighorn. Lots of bighorn. I don't even know if we'll be able to, like, see a rabbit from up here, but I was hoping to really scan around. And maybe we could see rabbits. The tough part about this area is that somehow, for me, the rabbits always escape me, and I thought by getting up high, I might get to see where they actually are, but I just... Oh, hold on. I was about to say I don't see any. I do, in fact, see some. There's a level two. Ooh, big two. And that's gonna be it. Alright, now the odds that we hit this aren't good. Uh, 370 meters. Oh my. On the move at that. Oh, so close. Wasn't close enough, I guess, to... Get him to stop. Dang it. Went from nothing to just fleeing. Hmm. Well, I know they're there, but maybe it would have been smarter to get a zone? I don't know. Why would... I guess it's maybe because of the shot. I was going to say, why would they be warning them? Because there's no bobcats here. Surely that's not in range to, um, just hear the shots. It must have been the ones that already fled. Not seeing any others. So, good to know those are there, unless they're going to come back, which, I mean, maybe, but, yeah. I think I might just try that again one of these times. I've been wanting to go chase pheasants this entire time, but... Getting distracted. B 
fit all the above. Spray and pray with the 22 is the ultimate hunting style. Yes. It's gotten... What was that? There was a kind of significant diamond duck at one point that we got that way. I actually recall it was the 22 pistol, but R1000 Mallard was sort of a spray and pray kind of deal. As long as you come with me, Kyle, I'll do it. I didn't think you would respond. I'd, I'd try. Try to make sure I respond. Advice on how to break the drink time lulls? It depends on what you mean by drink time lulls, I guess. Do you mean the time periods between drink times when you're kind of just like waiting on, you know, the next ideal time to go hunt something? Or what do you, what do you consider the <laughs> drink time lulls, I guess? Um, there were two there. I think we had hobby problems coming up first. Thank you for the super chat. Uh, since I started watching your vids, I've gotten rares and diamonds aplenty. Also, too many trolls, I feel that. Uh, favorite map is Silverage and Savannah. Uh. Nice. Two good maps. I like them both as well. Uh, Kaylee, thank you as well. 272. That would be the big rack then. Nice. And I'm glad I uh, pronounced that right. Try to make sure I get them right when I can, but yeah, 272 is about as big as they get. Since they changed the scoring, you don't see many even reaching 270 at this point. The spray and pray with the 22 reminds me of the Cape Buffalo with the 22 vid. That was a good time. That video still gets comments on occasion of people thinking it was going to be a real life thing. I'm. I'm not brave enough to go chase a Cape Buffalo with the 22. I don't know about anybody else. Excuse you. Not this way. Well, you're a tough little bugger. Oi! What do you think you're doing? There you go. Nope, still not flushing. There were two roosters. I don't even know where the other one is. Dude, what are you doing? The most... Stubborn boyo. Wow. Well. Got him, but that was rough. Even trying to get a shot lined up. Choked a level 9 red deer, 254 to 301. That's, to be honest, one of the highest estimates I've heard of on a red deer. That's kind of unfortunate. Hopefully, you get a chance for redemption on such things. Ooh. Another good rabbit. At least the respawns are kind of turning up decent. They're just not quite the threes we want. It's about 150. Cool. There were more. You know, it's kind of like the grizzly bear, oddly enough. The spawn rate for the antelope jackrabbit, like female to male, it feels like it's 3 to 1, 4 to 1. It makes it tough to just shoot a ton of them for respawns, but I think we're doing alright. That's a different one, right? We might never know. Was it you? I don't know. Anyway. Got trolled by level 5 mule deer. I think I know exactly what rack it would even be. That's... It's one of my favorite racks, but they just basically never make diamond. We'll probably go over that hill and see if we can spot any bunnies down that way. What's up, Cycle? Fessing Strugs? That was ridiculous. That was one of the worst I've seen. At people in those comments saying it's unethical? Uh, it's, it's entertaining when that happens, I must say. Chasing a pixel with a pixelated gun? I don't know. Can female animals spawn back as males? I don't think there's definitive proof, but... Everything I've seen says no, and it would make sense from like a development perspective. If you make it so only males spawn as males and only females spawn as females, then you sort of ensure whatever ratio you want to be on the map. Like, um, when the population file is generated, you say, say there's going to be a hundred, I don't know, pheasants since we're running around chasing them. Make it... 55 females, 45 males, whatever your ratio is, and then you always have that ratio as long as like only males become males and only females become females. 
but yeah, on occasion, shooting does out of a herd, you seem to get bucks spawned back. I saw that with red fox. Shooting some female red fox would get males to spawn in those areas. I think that's more of maybe like a respawn pull, a respawn not being immediate, or you know something along those lines. But no one except the devs and probably not even all the devs know the answer to that. Oh, hello. Look at all these guys in here. Running around. Bunch of small boyos. There's probably then, if I had to guess, rabbits that are just sitting right here somewhere. They often don't flee far, but it's just not a good place to do such things. Sounded like a male, but apparently it was a head. I wouldn't want to eat pixels. Probably taste glitchy. Probably so. I don't think they'd be the most nutritious meal. The rough part about going down through here, pheasants and, not pheasants, uh, coyotes and rabbits sound very similar. Like their footsteps. There's rabbits here, but like, are we gonna have any chance of seeing them? Probably not. Next animal they had, the antler doe. It'd be a kind of neat rare. I mean, I I almost shot one a couple of years ago and I sh it was a male deer, but I shot one that you could almost call an antler doe last year. Level three and everything, just not the species we want. Hmm. So many tracks. The odds that we even get to see them all aren't good. I mean, excuse you. If we line this up, <laughs> got the two. I wanted to get all three, but then that one started moving, and I was not about that. Uh, the best. Thank you for the super chat. Really appreciate you, man. Thank you for the support. How's it going? Twitch only stream? Twitch only streams? Wait, why? What? Too much going on? I don't know what's going on. I hear stuff again. I don't know what I hear. Excuse you. I just came down through there. How? I don't know. Guess we'll see if they run downhill. Sometimes they do. Rocky doing his thing, getting in the way. You agree with that one, Billy? What was... Was it just insanity of chat? What was the reason I missed it? Where are you? I know. I already know. If we see them, I'm going to run right up on them and spook them. Did it stop? Literally just saw it. Yeah, it did stop. Kind of them to do so, because half the time, we don't even. Hello. We don't even get uh, to see them if they're moving any kind of decent pace. There was another one up here. What's this track say? Old female. Old female. I don't know. I don't know. I guess we'll take the respawns and just get out of here because this is just thicker than where I want to be. Let's go uh, up through the lossy Andy area. Let's see what this does. Oh, you just like Twitch? Fair enough. Too many 12s? I see. I thought 12 was a good thing, though. What is your all-time favorite animal in Hunter Call of the Wild? Just like a species to hunt, or what uh, specifically? <laughs> Other thing we're going to do is switch this to evening, by the way. The best, thank you for the super chat again. Got a 100kg 272 diamond whitetail. Nice, man. Like I was just saying earlier, 272 is roughly as big as they get. Let's do... Yeah, we'll do right on 1700. That gives us about 30 minutes till dark. And then we can probably do like another iteration or two of that. That's the only negative I see, Kyla. How do I get out of here? I can never navigate this place. It all looks too similar. Okay. We'll go straight to the lake, I guess. Does anything drink, at least in this area in the evening? I'm not sure. 
But there's probably rabbits and stuff in here. <laughs> I got you, bottom boy. I see you. What's up, Zannies? My country is falling apart. Um, that's a little disconcerting. Threes. If you could choose any animal in any fur type to mix and throw in your trophy lodge, what would it be? Hmm. Let me think. To make sure I'm not misunderstanding your question, or actually here, in case I am misunderstanding your question, a crowned diamond wildebeest, because that's impossible. But I don't think you're asking me to pick a fur type that can't be an animal and then mix it and then pretend that it can. Uh... Diamond, leucistic, cape buffalo. Big horns, if I can really choose. What's up, Sogner? One and a halfs. 1.2s, there you go. Small knows what's up. For a new map, I think that a map in the Cascades would be awesome. That is in Oregon, by the way. I was about to ask, so thank you for clarifying. I appreciate it. I know there's some pretty decent hunting out that way. Which direction are we going in here? They're probably sitting here. Probably gonna all run out and surprise me. Maybe not. Hmm. All I know is there was a warning call, but everything says very old. Bunnies doing what they do best. Hunting bunnos, we're trying it. It's mostly sightseeing. Doing better at pheasant hunting than, every, than everything, than anything, I would say. You're stowed in the basement, correct. What's up, JJC? Thank you, man. I think they should do a map for Great Britain. There's enough unique species there that I could potentially see that happening. Would kind of be like a third fallow map, too. That is a little far. But a male. I'm pretty sure they feed right there, if I'm not mistaken, so... Ooh, it's a bunch of them. Let's see. Level one. At least there's more males in that group, but they're so far away, I don't know if we'll get them. Pretty nice Wi-Fi in the basement. Uh, yeah, you know those, um, hello there? Those extenders, just got them everywhere to make sure, you know, modding is up to snuff with the speeds. I don't know why that didn't even uh. alert that rabbit. I'm just, oh boy. Losing breath and everything. Please don't flee. I'll be so sad. Oh god. We got it. <laughs> that was rough. Um, Rebecca, thank you for the super chat. Is there good food in the basement, though? There's MREs and 12 gallons of water. It depends on if you like MREs or not. They're trying to ban farming? What? What you mean? Just got a 212 whitetail, it's a sign. I, for some reason, thought you meant in classic, and I was like, what? Just casually saying that? Why is the internet so good in the basement it sucks on the roof? Um... I don't know. Signal's worse on the roof, maybe. I can't answer that question. It violates my non-disclosure agreement with Keep Lucky on the Roof, Inc. In food, this is florist. I'd be floored if I were you. My dad shot his first time in spring work. That's cool. It's always cool to see, you know, like uh, multiple members of like a family or just friends playing the same game and that kind of thing. I still don't know where we're banning farming, but I'm probably not going to try to get into that discussion. Talk forever. Oregon, trying to ban hunting and animal farms? Oh my. That is a bold move. Not sure what I think about that one. I'm not Florida, I'm beyond Florida. Yeah, you're on the roof. 
You're well beyond the floor. Like, that's kind of the concept of the roof. What's up, RX? You pay rent, what a noob. Same though. Glasses time? Yeah, good idea. Not nap time though? Not yet. What's up, Ethan? And JJC, thank you, man. I like McDonald's, I mean, you know? Don't we all? They're also trying to ban fishing? You know, I don't want to get... I don't know if this is political. It's borderline political because that's the realm that it would be taken on in, but I, I'm i not sure people understand the potential negative consequences of taking out something that is so important to conservation unless they have a plan to, you know, do something else conservation-wise, but I, I would doubt it. Anyway. Palo doesn't have to pay rent? I thought Palo was elsewhere with cameras. It's a very rabbity looking stump, I must say. I thought we found that little group. You know what's annoying right now? Um, every time, <laughs> maybe I just gotta go back to the road. Every time that I do this, especially in the evening, there's like 12 rooster pheasants going everywhere. I'm getting rabbit warning calls. I'm like, I'm gonna do this on stream. In 40 minutes, we've, I mean, we're killing rabbits, but nothing to the degree that I expected to. Maybe they're just right down in there. Get ready to smoke them when they run off. I see one. I saw one. You little weirdos. They run and then stop. They're so deceptive. It's, it would almost be better if they don't stop sometimes. You'd think stopping just makes it easier to kill them, but I swear sometimes they're better off doing it. Is this a different group of them? Did the males continue to run? There's one of them. One of the smaller boyos. I know there was a two. Assuming this is the same group, which I'm getting less and less confident about with every passing second, there should have been... yeah. Trax says there is. I don't know where it went. It's small. It's fine. Hashtag beyond floor gang. I think it should be beyond floored. By the way, you know what else would be nice on our little rabbit grind here? An albino male. I would love that. You're lucky. Just gonna hip shot you in another second if you didn't run away. I, I don't know all the above. I'd have to look into it. But that sounds a little short-sighted to say the least. The cardboard dinner is getting old. Just put it in the microwave. It'll be fine. Don't put cardboard in the microwave. Actually, would re wait. How did we get? There's a max track. I didn't even know we were on it. Where's it at? It's a dark brown one. It's, I'm sure it's a two. Every max track we've had so far has been a two, but where? It's a bobcat, is it not? Surely doesn't care that we're here. I don't want to spot it because I want to stay on that track. I spotted it somehow by accident anyway. Cool. Okay. I uh, should have been... Right over here. I just... This says... Nothing. Why do I not know how old it is? Very old. I'm pretty sure this is the same one. I don't know what video it was in. Uh, I had the track and couldn't find the rabbit. Once again, track, no bunny. It's probably not worth attempting to track it down. They're just such a, a difficult species to track when the particle and glow doesn't work. Or just the particle, rather. Thank you for the disclaimer, Billy. Kitty murderer, listen. I needed a new dead cat from a microphone. It was fun to finally catch one of your streams again. Have a great one and stay safe. Thank you, man. Hopefully we'll see you around in one of the future streams. Mm. 
Make it happen, Kyla. Gonna try to do some interesting hunts this fall. I'm trying to make sure that I watch ahead of us for bunnies and stuff and read at the same time. There's also a decent pheasant track. Uh, anyway, May Filament. Want to do Waterfowl the 16 gauge. Bear with my 325. And I've been trying for a long time to get a deer with my recurve. I don't know, like for me personally, I'm not sure if I'll ever try to do that, but killing a deer with any traditional bow would be, I think, like, same level as, like, your first buck or your first deer memory, that kind of thing. Don't, don't do it, Lucky. I don't know if it's the same bobcat or what Rocky's growling at, but odd. The strug, Skyla, of specific items not being available lately. I don't even know. Yeah, Palo, I'd, I typed it out and everything. I'm glad I didn't hit send. That would have been awfully inconsiderate, to say the least. Huh. Small males for days. Kind of think. Nope, didn't read that right. I think I'm kind of hooked on bow fishing now. I think it'd be a lot of fun. I've just never had the opportunity to try it. Can imagine how one would get hooked pretty easily. No pun intended. Let's let's not tram. When are you gonna start a second great one grind? I'm waiting for the fix with the fur types. My reason is, uh, and actually, there's a pretty good example in the community and I really hope that it doesn't happen to the guy but he shot an albino great one if you haven't seen that it's in uh, the official discord somewhere there's a chance and like EW has made this clear when they do the retroactive fix for like the rare whitetail and coyotes in the lodge now that anything we've shot since the rancho update could change so his albino great one could end up becoming a common and I'd be terrified of having that happen or for that matter like any kind of decent melanistic or any melanistic at all I don't have a melanistic whitetail buck uh, in the new lodge anywhere I would hate to get one especially a good one and then have it become a common when they fix that that is why I'm waiting because you know when you're doing the great one cry that's when you're most likely to get those rares and stuff you're just shooting so many whitetail for the response Help me on board, this map should release already. If you're looking for something to do, perhaps a coyote hunt, try to get something for the multi-mount with the pair of predators, you could do that over on Layton. Uh, what's the other one? There's pheasants, there's rabbits, there's what, javelina? You could look for some kind of good turkey on SRP to get with one from uh, Rancho. Is goose hunting still the way to go to get loads of cash? If you're on PC, it's been fixed, and yes. If you're on console, Fallow Deer on Te Awaroa is still going to be the way to go. There's a small rooster. And a better rooster. And a coyote. Just everything on one little neat package there. How lovely. My piebald is common now? Yeah, exactly. I've got um, a couple of... Hmm. That was odd. Anyway. I've got a couple of rare whitetail in my lodge that are currently displaying as common. They said that should be retroactively fixed, so that means, you know, your old rares that are displaying as common should go back to displaying as rares when they fix it. Just a matter of kind of waiting for that to happen. <laughs> the best thank you for the super chat once again. I have a total of 12 diamonds on Rancho, 2 turkeys, and 10 whitetail. 12 diamonds is a good number. I like it. It's pretty good for, um... The map not being out that long. I see ya. You know what's cool about the pheasants? Um, when they flee... I don't think hit that. They run and go defensive and hide under some brush. And you can kind of, you know, when you're tracking them, even if you can't see where they are, you can start to look ahead. And when you see brush coming up, you can kind of start to be, you know, ready for it. You grab your gun, get ready for them to potentially flush. It's a, a nice little thing to be aware of, the fact that they do that. 
Thought it's been super rain in the bottom, boy. It's one of those days, I'm not sure what it is. I feel like slightly off compared to normal with all... I feel like I'm all over the place. I don't know if random is the right word, but I feel like I'm all over the place anyway. Pheasants for days, but they're all small males. Or hens, really, but, you know. Not the same impact. You have a melanistic pheasant? Nice. Was it a rooster? I don't even know what I want the most. The leucistics look really cool. The albinos look really cool. The melanistics look awesome. Like, they're all good. I really want one of each if I could get that lucky, but... The odds <laughs> certainly don't seem to be in my favor. It depends how much time we really spend on Rancho... You know, say six months from now. We still hunting Rancho fairly often because... There's something about pheasants. I don't know why. There's no such thing as like, you know, resisting the urge to shoot them when they fly over. I always try to kill them, so the respawns are going to be there. Um, Ed, thank you so much for the super chat for Kyla, because she helps so much. Tis deserved. Thank you, man. Kyla's favorite animal is water buffalo. Are we talking about parquet? What was that? Okay, that's one of the outposts that actually is there. Gotta be on the lookout for those hidden outposts. Um, just for the heck of it. I like to do, like, through the little cactus arms. Probably, like, a thumbnail background one of these days. You take money from my bank account every month and I never show up here? I like how that's phrased as if <laughs> that's my choice, but, uh, what is your... I don't think it shows me anymore. What is your member length, whatever it's called. How long have you been a uh, channel member? So many max weight big one around here, I never see them. Blue gun is fire. There's not many of them on YouTube. There's only a couple. It will, Grayson. Probably either Wednesday or Saturday. We'll have to see. Kyla's favorite animal is the black tail, though. Definitely. You got it. Okay. Um, where are we going here? I kind of want to go up here. I just don't have that great a rabbit luck there. What about... They're feeding now. Hmm, I was going to say... Like, up this road, but... Let's try it down here again. Eh, maybe not. I don't even know where to go. I don't know what to do. I guess we'll go here and go down the road. Why not? In one more month, I'll have double guns? That feels like it's gone by crazy fast, Billy. Time flies, I do suppose. Oh, yeah. I can't go to that outpost. Right. Okay, we'll go up the road instead. How do you become a channel member? I'm not a tech whiz. Uh, yeah, that link right there that Kyla posted will do it. Get good and you'll get diamonds? Are you referring to me with my lack of diamond bunnies? Getting good is difficult. Two years, five months, and 21 days. My goodness. I wonder if YouTube's ever going to allow more than two-year badges. I don't think memberships have existed a whole lot longer than that. I've probably been a member since nearly the time it was introduced. Is Rancho a new map? It is. Got some bunny tracks. A couple of males, but very old rabbit tracks. There's almost no point tracking them. Like I was saying earlier, the particle effect doesn't work, so you're literally looking for one tiny, small, little poop track. Do you think they should add bow fishing? That's actually a common question. I think if they were to do any kind of fishing in Call of Duty, it would have to be bow fishing. I would lean more towards, though, if they wanted to do bow fishing or fishing of any kind, it's probably best left to a different game. And, you know, EW can make it, but I, I feel like the Hunter Call of the Wild should be left to, you know, hunting. That sounds about right, Cell Shot. I don't know who's the longest, but he might be.
Can we have a nap date after this? Yeah. I didn't sleep well. We can have a nap date. The best places for Whitetail? She is better to ask than me for that, but I can maybe answer a little better because I can see the map. So this whole lake, you can see all these zones around it. It's all Whitetail. But uh, probably this spot and this spot of, you know, the zones are the best here. Beard got this great one up here. I've had some good luck here, but my map doesn't spawn any Whitetail there. This lake here, this lake here, and this lake can be alright. Sometimes. Depends on the server. No fishing in Call of the Wild? It's a, uh, pretty, like, polarizing question, because some people just think, you know, the more content, the better. Some people think, wow, that sunset, though. Anyway, some people think, um, there's too much potential for it to have bugs, and I'm kind of in that camp, to be honest. Wendy, thank you for the super chat, by the way. Really appreciate the support. Will there be new maps? You can expect new maps for quite some time in Call of the Wild. I think we'll continue to see two a year for a number of years yet. Why is Kyla's name highlighted, by the way? The blue names are moderators. Uh, basically, to put it briefly, people that have been in the chat for quite some time, you know, earned my trust, were super active in the chat, people that I saw as trustworthy to be able to mod the streams, that kind of stuff. And then the green names actually cycle coming in with a 12 out of 12 timing during this explanation. They are channel members. Oof. Kyla had the shorter explanation. Stream delay. Read hers. Hers is better. Lucky is blue. Yes. Nap date. I'll have to turn on the AC in here before that. It's already toasty. I've only been streaming for an hour. I had it running all morning to be like, yeah. Make it nice in here. And now, toasty already. It is, what, 80 ounce, so makes sense. Doesn't take long. You're the only person that makes me feel like I want to play Heave the Hunter? Well, I'm glad to. Hope you head out and give it a shot again. Let's see if we can smoke this real quick. Yep. That'll do. Um, Cycle, thanks for becoming a channel member, by the way. I'm sure you know the drill as far as linking stuff up, but appreciate you, man. That's a better one. Shot so far ahead, we didn't even hit it. Not the way that was meant to go. That's better. They say geniuses pick green? Yes. My room was like 85 degrees when I hit the stream last night. Do you have the same problem that I do, that the AC would be too loud to run it, or do you just not have it? It poured the rain for like an hour, then immediately got stupid hot right after. Yeah, that's the worst. When it gets that hot, then you have all that humidity from the rain. It's no good. 99 today. Go get in a swimming pool and never leave. Nice, pal. <laughs> I hear stuff. Some deer running around. Where's that bunny at, though? They're really not about the whole show me the bunny concept. They're pretty good at not showing me the bunny, in fact. Is that the zone? I know... Yeah, it's a female. By itself and everything. I was going to say, I know they feed at this time. What was dark? This Georgia weather, as soon as I say I don't like the heat, it's soggy and ready for the next week. I want the heat back. Gross. I don't think, uh... I wouldn't like either option. <laughs> Neither of those is good. Cries and been over 95 every day for the past three weeks. Is that why your attire was as it was when you were hiking around chasing badgers? What's up, Blitz? I must say, I prefer that profile picture. It catches my eye quite quickly. Wildfires are now everywhere? I, I can imagine. That cannot be good. I like 
bow hunting roe deer. Those smaller deer species that you can always kind of instant drop with an arrow, it tends to be a little more satisfying when you get to do that. Sense make all the above. I can understand the reasoning. That's a decent one. I uh, don't know that we're going to get a shot at it, but it's a decent coyote. I saw, yeah, so I, I wasn't sure if the ground was in the way or not. I was just shooting at an outline, and unfortunately, the ground was in fact in the way. Oh, jeez, all the above. That'll... It's probably like just living in an oven, toasting everything up. Are the coyotes going to turn the same way the whitetail just did? Are the coyotes going to completely disappear? Well, I surely don't know where the level 7 went, but it was a nice idea. I mean, we're kind of good on coyotes at this point, so not too worried. Went to a place recently that got to 115. I genuinely felt like I was going to die after being outside for just 15 minutes. That's like extreme level heat. It's no good. Sad I've been waiting so long for the new map. I'm on Xbox. Yeah, unfortunately it's taken longer than uh, you know, really everyone had hoped, but hopefully sooner rather than later. I gotta yield, I gotta find it at some point since it's max weight to focus on the grind though. Yeah, I know you're ignoring literally everything else. I've had um three or four max weight coyotes on my map. They've all been sevens or eights though. Sounds good, Mason. We'll hopefully catch you in a future stream somewhere. Is there a special animal you'll hunt today? We're pretty much just chasing rabbits, but anything that we can kind of come across. It's about to get dark on us, and I'm hoping that maybe, like, out in... There's some fields coming up. Maybe the rabbits that are in this area are going to be out feeding. I sort of just thought of this a little bit too late, but... Usually, like, if I run up this pass, I do it during rabbit rest time, and I spook them like I know they're around, but I don't see them. Maybe here, with the... the time being set correctly, we'll get to actually spot the rabbits and see what's around. I am genuinely, uh, surprised, though. I've been shooting so many rabbits for respawns, it's gone fairly well every time I've done it. And then, like I said before, we go out for a stream and they're just all hiding. What's that about, Kyla? Bunnies are literally broken? Wait, why so? I don't know how well you guys could hear that, but that was like the lowest... It kind of, like it was realistic, it was sort of a growl. Uh, growl grunt, what do you call that? There's a vocalization that deer do that's called a growl. It sounded like that, but it was so low and creepy at first. Almost just got a diamond goose? Does that mean you got a goose that was close to diamond or a level 5 got away? I could see him being either one. We should duck hunt sometime? If they ever were to change the duck hunting to make it more like the goose hunting in this game, I would be a lot more a fan of that. I don't even duck hunt, really. I just sort of see them in the distance and shoot them with the 22. More, uh, you know, stuff along those lines. <laughs> Thought that was a bobcat? I'm glad you could hear it, at least. Um, Rebecca, thank you so much for the super chat, by the way. There are more than 600 people in this stream, so Flinter cannot possibly read every message. He's not ignoring you. He is the best. Oh, well, thank you. Uh... She is right, though. I promise. I try to read as many messages as I can. They uh, fly by. If you're, if you're curious, I believe there's approximately three thousand chats per stream. You know, in those two hours. So, how many does that? How many would I have to read in? Uh, let's say there's fifteen hundred in an hour. Oh, that's that's above my pay grade for that level of math. More than I can possibly read and answer. I try though. I look for questions. I look for you know stuff that's different as much as I can. Kind of the best. 
I think you're right. The other half of the best is unfortunately in Georgia right now. Have you ever played Minecraft? I've sort of played it. Um, my sister had the PC version, so I've, like, she let me play it once or twice there. She had it on Xbox, and every now and then she would convince me to join her for that. And I had, like, the pocket version when I was, I don't know, 12. Not that young, but stuff, stuff like that. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Palo. I got to read 15,000 messages an hour. Thanks for, thanks for doing that math for me. Goodness gracious. Big math strokes. Yes. <sighs> Yikes. The ultimate big male when it comes to reading? Yes, me and my ability to pronounce the words that I'm saying. I see you, Rack. Don't worry. Hi there. Um, you're not as bunny-like as I had hoped to see when I came up here. So where are they hiding? Like, I know places that I see rabbits. <laughs> We've gone there. And we're not killing them. Nice of you to drop by. Guess before we leave, might as well. Okay. Rude. I don't know. I'm guessing it's that one. Well, thank you, Blitz. The pro, I'm not sure about that. Not sure about a pro, but I try. Alright, little 4.1 gobbler. Do we go over there? Are we even going to get to see that rabbit? Probably not. We'll run this general direction. In the meantime, for a second, let's try to figure this out. I was considering going up this road. Like, there's there's rabbits there, but there's so few and far between running that. Like, if you guys want to see the next 40 minutes of killing a rabbit every 10, I feel like that's what that would end up being. So, I don't know. I feel like that's more of like a video thing where you can cut out all the boring parts. Where, oh where? I mean, we can go back to... Let's do that, actually, while it's their feed time. I know it's a little bit dark, but let's go back down where we saw that one of their big rabbits. It's a two, we know that. But we might as well kill it. Yeah, I figured. Feed zone with one female bunny. I try. Pro yes, even Chez said that earlier. I heard about such things. Can you show me your game settings with the colors? Like the track colors? I can. I assume you mean track colors. This stuff. Hopefully that's what you meant. Wrong direction. You know somewhere else we can check is actually down here too. The nice thing about Rancho the required loadout does allow you space to carry the night vision binoculars as well. Nice for these times when they're a little more necessary. Just got a 265 high ball moose. Nice, dude. I haven't had like a really big rare bull moose since they got true Rex. I used to kill them all the time, like... 890s, I had one 900 something which I recorded and then like for some reason never got into a video. But yeah, all, like we've had f I think four gold rare bull moose, but they've all been, you know, small golds. Okay, there's bunnies there, uh, but seemingly not the group with the bigger one. There's some down in here too who can't see. right area. All females? It's such an odd thing, but I don't know how they work just yet to know if that's normal. I guess sometimes it happens with other rabbits. Well, I don't know. Anyway, we'll focus on the group that certainly has males in it. Is there two different males? I think. So if we can get into like a hundred, probably dropping both won't be that bad. What's the actual range? About 150 now? That might work. Because it gives you a little bit more time to get the shots off. Uh, with it being dark though. 
it's what? Basically far left, and that guy. Ah, wait, did we get it? We killed one there. I think we killed the wrong one. We got two of them, but I'm pretty sure. Really? <laughs> it ran right before that follow-up shot that would hit. Anyway, pretty sure one of those was uh, not the right rabbit. Hobby problems. Thank you for the super chat, by the way. Real quick, what lore do you like the most for Sika Deer? I'm using the bleat, and it works. I had on females, not so much on males. I tend to use the red deer uh, color just because I have it when I'm on that map anyway. I've not noticed any one color working better than another, though, to be honest. I've just kind of used whatever I have. I used the elk color a little bit, but it didn't seem to do much for me. Yeah, we got a female there with a long shot, even. Go figure. All right, you know what? What I don't often do is go this direction for rabbits. So while we're here, I know it's dark, but they do seem to be a little more active this time of day. So we'll give it a shot. Rabbit sandwich, it pretty much was. I probably should have gotten closer and used birdshot, but I was pretty confident we could have done that. And really, I guess had I known there was a female in the way, we'd probably been fine. Just was not aware. I take it you're heading off, Sandys. If that's the case, we'll catch you later. There's some more. Okay, good. Maybe this is a little bit of a new leaf kind of deal. I don't know why. There's... Is that the one that's got a better estimate, right? There's three males in here. Again, I've said this for so many 4kg antelope jackrabbits. It technically does have a chance at five to six. It's it's probably a goal, but I can't not shoot it, especially because we need respawns, but when there is a chance they can make it. It's about 170 out, so if we take this shot now and hit it, um, the others aren't going to spook. If we shoot over it, that's not really um, quite as good. We'll just go slow and let him calm down. 43 minutes left of the stream. I don't know how it's going so fast. Uh, Jacob, thanks for renewing your channel membership, by the way. I really do appreciate that. I don't like that this hill is here and it sort of obscures the rabbits. Like, I. Something so small and so difficult to track when it's in view and it has a chance of being decent. I'd rather take it and risk smoking the. Smoking? Smoking the small ones? That's a new one. Add that to the flictionary. My goodness. That, like, offended me that I just said that word. <laughs> I don't even know what it means. Good shooting. Yeah, 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 definitely. Definitely not terrible. Where are you? Rabbit aim? Something like that. Stay, please. Thank you. Got them all in the end. 100 meters, Kylo. Somebody plays Call of the Wild. I do that too. I've done it <laughs> in my IRL videos. Um, I'll be sitting there and I'll be like, you know, doing my pre hunt interview thing. And I'll talk about like a shooting lane that's 20 meters away, and then I'll be like, no, no, it's not Call of the Wild. I use yards when I hunt. Gotta redo it. Did you roll? Um, Spud the Dirt Biker, thanks for becoming a channel member, man. Welcome. I do appreciate you. If you're not in the Discord already, make sure you join that. Link up your YouTube. By the way, that is not going to be a diamond level 2. Uh, get the member rule. Take advantage of the good stuff that comes along with that. And enjoy the green name and emojis here in chat as well. I'm pleased that we're killing bunnies. I will say that. I don't love that we're having to do it at night, but the fact that it's working better makes me want to at least continue to give it a shot. I still can't believe us had smoking though. Just missed a shot on level three rabbit. Now it's gone away in the dark. Are you on Rancho? If so, um, I understand your pain. There's, they're so tough. Once they're, you know, fleeing and out of sight, it can be really, really tough to ever see them again. Especially in multiplayer. I can't tell you how many 4KG 
rabbits I've not killed in the end that have gotten away. It's quite a few. Okay, here's the plan. Gonna build this while we're here. Just for the heck of it, we've cleared the pressure. I killed a bunch up in here. Um, I'm gonna reset back to like 1730 so it's gonna be light out at least. And then we'll try that again. Kind of would be nice if America would just go metric. Yeah, I think you have too many people proud of the fact that we're not. I wouldn't mind either way. You know, at this point I know yards and such well enough, but it would be nice if everybody was sort of on the same page there. I like the challenge though on the rabbit boys. You know what's interesting about, um, you know, the whole tracks thing, the particle effect not working? I like the challenge it presents. It makes tracking a lot less guaranteed, a little more realistic you might say. But something needs to be done to enhance rabbit tracks, I think, and bobcat tracks just a little bit then. Because most species, it doesn't make it, I won't say impossible, but so impossible feeling. Hello? Uh, sure. Uh. Not the level three we're after, you know? Is that a common? Because that's what we're missing. It might well be. Um, Spud the Dirt Biker, thank you so much for the super chat as well, by the way. I really do appreciate that. Thank you, man. Thank you, thank you. Flinglish moments? There are many. There are many. You know what I gotta do? Can we kill this with a shotgun? I've not shot a diamond Rio Grande with a shotgun yet. Where it would be... I mean, he's still just walking this way. I wish I had decoys, but I'm not about to run back and get them when he's just chilling out here. What was that? Oh. It was a bighorn, but I thought it was something white. Okay, now where? Yeah. Can we get him to come this way? He's walking this way. Still just feeding though. Gonna be a buff? I thought the buffs didn't have like the green feathers. Okay, let's see. I don't know what he is, but he's coming in, so we'll just sort of scoot back. Like I said, I wish I had the decoys because it makes them more likely to strut, but just kill them all with the shotgun would be neat. What I'm going to do real quick is that, because it would just be lame to try to take the shot and then have that uh, happen. JB, thanks for renewing your channel membership as well. All the four-month renewals today. Thank you, guys. Where is... Perfect. This would be, this is where I like to turkey on. Like when I'm back kind of tucked into a place. It's tough to film, but this is the kind of stuff I look for. I like it. I can't do missions on any map. I'm not aware of that being a glitch, but if it is, that's concerning. Slowly but surely. What's up, Tux? Good timing. Got a little surprise level three turkey boyo coming in. Are you uploading today? I don't upload on Mondays or Fridays. We just had a conversation earlier. Uh, there may possibly be uh, uploads on Fridays at some point here. I keep forgetting that cuts off the thing. I like that it does, but anyway. Um, yeah, Mondays is just the YouTube stream, and Fridays currently is just the Twitch stream. At least turkeys don't disappoint me in Call of the Wild, unlike in real life. Same for me. I'm really trying not to get my hopes up too much because you never know what's going to happen um, when you're looking at, you know, house and property. But the place that I went to look at yesterday, those of you that were at the Subnautica Twitch stream will have heard me saying that. Kyle and I were talking about it. I saw turkeys on the property and I was like, my goodness. I walked around for like over 100 hours easily in May trying to find turkeys where I knew where they lived. And I can just walk there and find like a whole flock of them. Maybe that's the place. Who knows? i will be mad if it rains again tomorrow. There's a lake that needs me and my kayak to be in it. Is that so? Interesting. How do you buy the DLC for Rancho de Royal? Uh, if you're on PC, it's just in the Steam store. Take your time, buddy. Do you have every diamond in the game? I don't have a diamond antelope jackrabbit, which is... Why we're here, but we're currently preoccupied with a 
what should be a diamond turkey, unless we would have the weirdest way of messing this up. Level 3 turkeys are a guarantee. What's up, winners? Good to see you, man. I will BRB, gonna grab a drink and get my game going to start the grind. Sounds good, dude. Sounds good. What are you? Are you a common? I can believe it. I see that green kind of like sheen to the feathers. Green sheen? Yes. Do you have an albino Rocky Mountain Elk? I have two of them, in fact. Two very tiny bulls and a cow, I guess. There are currently six words in the Flictionary surprisingly underwhelming. I'm sure you're just missing some. Is Texas exotic in there? What do I say when I try to say it? I just have to go slow so I don't mess it up. I think I do... Texix is usually my word. Have you set out camps for deer season yet? IRL, of course they have. And if you have, have you seen any potential big deer? There's a couple that I think have decent potential. There's nothing, you know, that are definite giants. What's your deal over there, dude? Hanging up like a real life gobbler. This way, please. 4.800%? Maybe so. How am I meant to spook pheasants? Uh, really, you just gotta run at them. It's kind of annoying, but it's the only way that works. Are you gonna go back to your feed zone? Uh, you know, if we weren't chasing rabbits, I'd make more of an effort here, but, um... No thank you, sir. Not doing that. You got it, Billy. Do you have decoys? I wish I did. I would have had to go back and redo my loadout and everything, and once again, I, if I wasn't chasing rabbits, I'd probably spend more time. See, okay. If I can get them from my brother Bottom Boy, I will. But he's the one that handles all such things. He's got a couple of them saved. I have to like take pictures of my screen, I guess, and usually I just let him save them, but he's the one that has access to them all. Spook pheasants by shooting, it'll spook them in the distance. Twelve miles away. What are you, by the way? Ah, it's a light brown. Still cool, I suppose, but not the common that I was hoping for to complete our collection. What do we got then? Just a little 4.6, but nice to get another one. Not sure it's going to be one necessarily that goes anywhere in the lodge, because it's a lower weight one. Definitely for, you know, maybe a multi-mount somewhere, something like that. Another thick boyo. I want a map in South America with oscillated turkeys. There are a lot of people saying that we should have gotten oscillated instead of Rio Grands here. I don't know. I like the Rio Grands. I think they did a good job. Lucky turkey? Wait, why was it lucky? I'm not sure I understand why. What I miss? Dream Hunt IRL? Hey! <laughs> Back-to-back -back diamond turkeys. Easy. Okay. Interesting little, uh... How far apart were those? That might be a record for me. Um... Less than two minutes. It's a minute on the date and time thing. Anyway, caribou in Alaska, I think, is my dream hunt. That's what I was trying to get at before diamond turkey numero dos showed up. Got couple of bunnies. Is this the group that was only females? Yeah, that Kyla or see, remember we talked about like the FAQ video? The thing is, if we just link a FAQ in the chat, people are just going to want the answer and not to have to go and watch the video to find out. So I suppose we better make it a command. If you want, I mean, Billy's here. You could probably do it. Otherwise I can Go and make one quick. Billy is the bot wizard. I think you also had to figure out how to make a command in the chat now. All of these small female rabbits. It's not it. What happened? 
Head straight to my tripod and spook. Do you have something interesting? I'm gonna scroll up here and see if he's dead. Stuff. Oh, level 9 coyote? Dang. What would you like me to do? Uh, get your coyote. We'll worry about it later. It's just a little informational command. Priorities. No worries, Kyle. I was just saying, if you uh, want to give it a shot, here, I'll even do it. I got you. I got you. It's going to take me 12 years. You get some typing ASMR, but it'll be fine. Okay. Uh, dream Hunt. Can't spell. Give it a shot, see if it works. The cactus mechanic be smart? It's, I think it's a smart thing they added it. And it doesn't do too much damage. But here's the reason I think it's actually smart. Because it's almost never going to be a thing that you die because of a cactus. Can you imagine if they did have cactuses all over the map? But, whoa. <laughs> but they didn't do damage? You, you would just get a lot of people being like, well, why don't the cactuses hurt? You run into them. So they're just better off causing a little bit of damage. Um, you know, it, it does what people would probably ask for, but you're not going to have, you know, a million questions like, well, they would hurt you in real life. This is a simulator, right? A couple of small males, by the way. That one, oh boy. Ah. Couldn't get my crosshairs centered. I knew it was somewhere to the left. There should have been a little more. Really? Nah, not getting away. Anyway, I should have been a little more patient with such things. Flinter's dream hunt is whatever you're willing to pay for. When you say you, are you referring to the person asking the question? 666 viewers. Mine says 668. Can you get stuck in the big ones? You can get stuck in the big ones. I have yet to get stuck in any cactus. I don't know what you're doing. But I'm doing it differently. On the run, air gun, diamond, coyote, Billy. Is that what's happening here? Look at this action shot. Big ol' eyes. I thought I had a max weight track in this area, by the way, for a rabbit. It could be the one that we killed earlier, though. There's another male. As for where it is, no one knows. I'm supposed to look back this way further, actually. I uh, wasn't able to join the stream until now. Anything good yet? Back-to-back uh, -back diamond turkeys, actually. Not the one common plumage type we're missing. It was light brown and buff, I think. That was nice to be so loud. But, um, yeah, we killed a level three. A big two flew by, we smoked that one, they were both diamonds. Oh, that makes sense, Lucky. I thought, like, you ran into it and somehow got stuck. It made so little sense to me, but I understand. Okay, we can make it this 500 meters before it gets dark, and then we're probably going to go to 5 a.m. and do a little bit of, like, combination pheasant and rabbit hunting. If he gets real annoying, I'm ending him with the 243. I mean, why not? Might as well. What do you think about fixing ducks? I think it probably needs done. Um, geese are not great, but when you compare them to ducks, they're a lot better. And I think that's probably the way they should handle the ducks. Have them, you know, be a thing you have to call in. They fly over in like flocks. Stuff like that. Now, it is good that they are just sort of like ambiently on the map as well. But, I don't know. Shooting them 300 meters away off a lake with a 22 is about the lamest way I could imagine getting a diamond duck. And we've done it with possibly hundreds. Probably hundreds when you consider cinnamon teal. I'm pretty sure nah. you can't do it anymore, bottom boy. Actually, you might be able to do it still. But the timing required would be a lot more precise. In my experience, the health goes down so fast 
that you don't have time to use the medkit. I'll give it a shot here in a second. Uh, the best thank you for the super chats. Oh, I just saw. I think it's still there. I don't know what you are, but I'm gonna shoot you. Maybe. Anyway, is a Oka gold colored factory good? Okray? Possibly, is that what you're saying? Uh, yeah. <laughs> if I'm understanding correctly, it's actually a kind of like an uncommon, but a gold is a a gold uncommon or anything is a solid little trophy. Diamond for Coyote is 56.8, Billy. So back in here somewhere, I know there is a rabbit zone in some multiplayer servers. I don't know if it's on mine, but I'm kind of just trying to remember anywhere where I've had success with rabbits and trying to go there. Tis what I do, bottom boy. I've got a tent uh, right at the lookout here. Quickly, before we do such things, I'll scan around and look for bunny rabbits. That got the goal heart racing, haven't had that in a while, good. Are you still going to claim it, I take it? Are you going for another great one? Once they fix the fur type thing, I am. In less than 200 white tail kills, I have shot seven diamonds and one great one. It seems to be happening more and more since Rancho release. Vital Blood, nice. Let's see what we have going on around here. When I fired up the ATV earlier to go from here to there and place the tent, there were rabbits warning thumps. Does that mean we're going to see any from here? Probably not, but worth the time to scan around, I figure. I know they feel like along the road so often, but I don't see any. Okay. I'm gonna try this. If you watch how fast the health goes down, that's the problem. Let's see if I can time it, though. This should kill me. It should be high enough. Ugh. Nope, not high enough. That was like the top, though. You can still use the health kit that quickly. I've died falling off of these before. Maybe I should jump? Maybe that'll be better. Take two. Take twelve. Oh boy. Eh. Let me back up. I had it so perfect. <sighs> yeah, okay. So, it's not that the health goes down fast. It's immediate. So no. Liver shot on a 57.8 diamond coyote. Nice, Billy. Good size, boyo. Don't try... Th yeah, I should have had the don't try this at home. Warning. Okay. 5.48 a.m. That'll last us for the last 20 minutes here. Hopefully some rooster pheasants and bunny boyos to come here. Where are we going to do this? I say... We'll go down from the lodge, scan around. I want to actually drop down in here too. And then, uh, see what's around to shoot. Instantly, indeed. Have you shot any coyote string or grind billy? Or was that like the most random of random encounters? <laughs> Are you looking forward to real life deer season? I really am. Um, if plans go as I'm hoping they do, uh, there will be even more excitement around such things. Does anyone know how many hours I had to put into my... to get my first diamond of anything? Not that many. Uh, about 100 hours. My... I got my diamond musty around 100 hours. About 200 hours till I had... maybe 150. Till I had my diamond brown bear, and then it was quite some time between that and my diamond coyote, the 1000. From there, it started to pick up a little bit. I'd like to know. I'll do that one week. I'll count my hours and total diamonds, just to see, like, how many hours per diamond I sort of put in now. 
drew a whitetail tag for Kansas this year. Nice, dude. That should be a, a pretty good time. What happened to last year's pronghorn hunt? Uh, essentially due to the circumstances surrounding uh, everyone trying to go, I wasn't able to uh, go along with G and... Oh, hi. I didn't know those were down there. Anyway. Um, yeah, I didn't... Like, I looked to try to get someone else to come with me that would maybe have a better idea of what they were doing than I would. Unfortunately, I was unable to find such a thing and yeah also traveling like a 30 hour something drive by myself wasn't something I was really trying to do at the time so it never happened last minute changes that's that's pretty accurate it was rather last minute that's quite a quite a few hours blitz I'm at 120 and still no diamond for me yet. I don't think that's too out of the ordinary. Where was that? Down here. Okay. Have you ever been... What? Should have thought about the stream of hunting wabbits. I probably should have. Maybe that would have been the key phrase to make a diamond rabbit to spawn because I don't know what else to do. Nice new life. I'm a beginner. What does dying do? Is it bad? I don't... I'm not sure it affects anything. Uh, it is tracked. Uh, here? Downed critters. I don't even know what that is. I think it might be the old rabbits and squirrels that weren't claimable. Casualties are like I've died a thousand times. Co-op harvest and stuff. By the way, like, a lot of those thousand deaths were just being stupid, like, with the bridge jumping on Yukon and stuff like that. You know what's funny, Billy? You guys know them better than me. I can't hear my music on YouTube streams. I do hear the Twitch stream music. Uh, but this is... It's like a... I think it's 40 minutes or something. I'm not sure how long the file is, but it, it loops on YouTube streams, and... Yeah, because of the way that I do that, I never hear it. It just plays. That should be awesome, bottom boy. I, from what I've seen, <laughs> plans should be in place because you have some potential there. A lodge full of small fur types. I like it. Are you ever going to do an IRL elk hunt as well? I've been working on getting preference points for such things. Hopefully I can uh, get to do one one day. Later, Grayson. How do you join the Schuster Army thingy? Uh, the Schuster Army is just like the, uh, you know, everybody that is subscribed to the channel, essentially. Everybody in the community. So if you're subscribed already, you're already a member of it. Small level two. Come to Norway to hunt grouse in the mountains? Um, I believe that it's fun. I actually, one of my oldest friends from the Hunter Classic lived in Norway, and that was something he did quite a lot was grouse hunting uh, with like a, I think he had a 410 actually. I remember him sending me a little bit of footage. It did look fun. Could imagine it being quite a lot of fun actually chasing him around up there. I'll do my best, Paolo. Thanks for uh, stopping by. Enjoy Age of Empires. I think they should make another lodge that's in a desert. I was... I don't know who I had this conversation with, but, um... Maybe it's too... Maybe it would be too obviously, like, Cabela's-esque, I guess. But I kind of want a, a lodge with, like, a mountain like Cabela's does their center display there. Like, if you could have... You know, your... Whitetail and mule deer and mountain goat and all, like all over that mountain like the way they do it I could just imagine it looking really cool. They have like most of the species that would um, Fit on such a thing But like I said if it's if there's potential issues with making it similar to what Cabela's does I can imagine why they wouldn't do it Where can I obtain onto primal I did a video on my second channel of how to do that if you want to check that out 
second channel is just called Flantro, by the way. Uh, not for me, bottom boy. There's a way, I think, if you log out of your Google account and log back in, don't do that if you don't know your, um, <laughs> credentials, obviously. Next, Geo's taken with the Texas Heart Shot or bad. We, we kind of figured Texas Vital Hit. See, I've been saying that I was going to take it with the Recurve. I wouldn't be the first. I believe Pro XDK has a great one with a Recurve. Great one! <laughs> Texas vital hit with like the crossbow would be hilarious. I kind of want to do it. I'm also terrified that the penetration wouldn't be there. I'd have to test it like a lot and really find out what works. How late is it where you live? It is almost 5 p.m. here in PA. Not too late. Couple of bunnies down there. They blend in so well. I guess that's the point. But uh. They can be kind of tough to see, just chilling there, not moving. I think we got the only male. No, we did not. He'll probably slow down in sight. Okay, that was worthwhile coming up here already to kill a couple of males. Sometimes, it, I don't get it on my map, but it happens in multiplayer. There will be a rest zone out here with like 30 rabbits, and it sort of amazes me that I've not seen a level 3 on that. I think so too, Blitz, but uh... Did... Was that my internet, or was that Discord going down? I hope it was Discord. I mean, my chat's still updating, I think we're okay. Freaking me out a little bit. Uh, anyway. I, I just worry about... You know, specific situations, you never know. You can get some weird stuff happening in Call of the Wild, so I'd be a little afraid trying to try that, but I don't know. Given the right circumstance and some patience to line up the shot, it should be, you know, fairly routine <laughs> if you practice it. Ow. Twist Discord? Okay, good. Oh, good. I got the glitch for medkits don't work. I think you get that glitch when you try to do the cliff thing, so uh, would not recommend. That is our group of rabbits that we saw. I guess no pheasants have respawned here. Because we killed a couple earlier. Still alive. Still breathing. Thank goodness. Small boyo and probably another small boyo. They weren't fantastic estimates. Should have done a video when Kylo was there, Q&A with a face cam, uh, explaining how we met. I guess if you want to go back to like how we started talking, that would make more sense. The whole how we met thing. I mean, it's make a plan to pick her up at the airport. It's not the best story, sadly, but I think I know what you mean. Where the heck is the male rabbit that we shot? In the meantime, I figure we'll check out here in this area, but did I run by it? Ah, oh, yeah. What have you got so far? Two different diamond turkeys, uh, both small, a level two and a level three actually. They were back to back, uh, about a minute apart. Did not know the level two was even there, it just sort of flew by and we popped it after killing the level three and ended up with two diamonds. Killed a level nine buffalo, but it went out of render. Will it despawn? Yeah, and it'll probably not have horns in the Trophy Lodge, unless you're on PC and have gotten the Rancho update. I'm pretty sure it's going to despawn and not have horns, if you were able to recover it, that is. So a rooster somewhere in here. If I remember right, actually, we didn't kill them both. I tried, but the one rooster was just running around for 12 years. I don't know where they are, but perhaps we can be ready? Why does that keep happening? Oh, hi. Small roosters for days over here. This is where I shot my diamond in multiplayer. All the ones in single player have been pathetic. Where you at? I know you flushed too, I heard it. Way over there. It's got a hundred sneak ability. 
that look like an okay buck? I don't think it was huge, but... I don't know, anyway. We got our one. We'll just take that and continue grounded. I don't know, he had been flying for longer than the diamond was when we killed that. I guess that's good to know. Be careful giving them time to get off the ground as well. I haven't had that issue at all before. I missed something there, I think. Cameron, thank you so much for the super chat, by the way. Years ago... Actually, two super chats there from Cameron. Thank you, man. I really do appreciate it. Met by telling chat no cast before it was a roll. Yeah, that's, um... It's a roll that I'm, you know, quite pleased exists and everything now, but that is very much the case. I never said it to be a roll. It was Kyla's thing to begin with, and, uh... Not only is it a rule in this chat, it's pretty well standard across most streams in the community now. Go figure. A little weirdo running in circles. Ah, go again. I think you're the one that we missed out on. Rocky. Pushing us to the side as we're trying to do this. I guess we're just chasing pheasants now. I don't have an issue with that. How do respawns work in terms of level and score? Will it come back bigger? I believe it's all entirely random. Um, you know, we've done a bunch of grinds. I can't say for certain that any one tactic has produced bigger or smaller respawns, like over 1600 whitetail. Nothing stood out to me as usually spawning like a bigger buck or a diamond or anything like that. I think, you know, you shoot a... I don't know, shoot a rooster pheasant, another rooster pheasant, random score, fur type level, all that respawns. Maybe there's an algorithm to it, but I certainly can't figure out what it would be. Rude Rocky, he's doing what he does. What he does. What shotgun is that? That is the Ranchero, I think? The 16 gauge. Kuso, yeah, the Ranchero. If you do the whistle, does it make the pheasants fly? It does if they're not defensive. I think they need to adjust the way it works. Let me see if I can find these pheasants here so I can show you. But essentially, when you spook a pheasant, they don't fly. They run and find brush, and they hunker down under that. And it is realistic, but they then get into the defensive state. That's They're defensive when they're hiding, and you can't whistle to spook them. You have to run up to them. you got to get within... 5-10 meters to get them to actually flee. It's a little... That part of it I don't, I don't love. I wish the whistle was more effective. Or, I wish when you did run near them, they just flush. But they do like a lot of running around and not flushing immediately. It just... It's not the most... I don't know about realistic, but you just sort of chase them around sometimes. And that's not, in my opinion, a good thing. Um, Cameron, thank you for the super chat once again. Amazing videos, keep it up. I will definitely do my best. Thank you, man. I do appreciate that. Got like five minutes here. I don't know where that rooster that called was. I was hoping to get eyes on him. The thing was, I believe we spooked him with the last gunshot, so he's likely defensive somewhere in the brush. Over here, they like to hide right in this area. I just don't see them here, so... I don't know. Anyway, I want to go right here. So we got to go like around the mountain. And with the time we have left, we'll probably check that. And that'll be about it. Big oof, I've been gone too long. I forgot who Rocky was for a minute. Poor little fella. Forgotten. Come here. Quit being a antisocial boyo. Now go. For beginner, what are the first things to buy with game money, not DLCs? Probably the 7 mil and... Uh, 7 mil and... Yeah, if you can... It takes some levels to get there, but some of the better stuff is like these binoculars. Med kits might be a smart thing to get a hold of. Once you buy the 7 mil, though, you're looking pretty good. Uh. Cycle, thank you so much for the super chat, by the way. 
I think it's fair to say Kyla is a very big part of this community and deserves as much recognition as any content creator. I agree. Sleep deprived and now emotional. It's true though. I try to get you to see that sometimes. I know it's it can be difficult. I understand it. But not only are you like a known figure, is that a word I want to use? In this community, you're a moderator for EW in their streams. You're in like literally every streaming community and everybody knows you. And it's not only because of consistency and, you know, always being there. It's because of character. I think you should be recognized as well. Kyla has created some content via Diamond Kaya. She has, and there's a fellow guide coming as well. If she wasn't already a moderator in the official Discord, I'd be a, I'd uh, see if I could get her the content creator rule. But um, the mod rule was higher anyway. They should give Mexico free for all the console players for the wait. I think there's very little chance they would do that. It'd be nice if they would do something. Uh, give everybody 100,000 cash to mount their Mexico trophy, something like that. Cameron, thank you for the super chat once again. Have a wonderfully blessed day. You too, man. Thank you so much for all the support. Tuck's in here smoking Kyla. Rude. Kyla is the mod? I mean, she's literally everywhere. I couldn't do it, I'll tell you that. I can play Call of the Wild for many, many hours. There's some things that I can do a lot. Modding and the amount of stuff she does for the community is not something I can manage. Favorite animal in this game? I think still Whitetail. I do quite like the Mountain Goat and Pronghorn. What if there was Call of the Wild PvP? How would they do that? I don't know that you could do that. I, I actually was approached one time to do some kind of like Call of the Wild esports event. I don't know how they wanted to run it, but the only possible way to make it fair would be to put everybody on the same population file or run it in multiplayer. And I just, I wasn't a fan of trying to do such things, so I sort of bowed out of that. But some people want to do stuff like that. MVM, 100%. The community mod? I mean, when she's in EW's streams and Discord as a mod, I think that is a more than fitting and applicable term. Alright, nothing here. What do we do? Let's go to this tent. Funny enough, we're giving Kyla all kinds of praise right now. She has gotten more respawns in this area than I have, so we'll see what is here from such things. First one to find a diamond or rare? I think you really could run a pretty cool Call of the Wild tournament. Not first one to kill a diamond or rare necessarily. Um, and it was it would have been better on the old scoring system. If you just added together the score of your top uh, kill of each <laughs> species on the map, I think it could work pretty good. But the problem is, now without the old scoring system, what you'd get, like let's say you do it on Layton, well, everyone's going to focus on Whitetail Elk and Moose. Because when Coyote Max is at 60 and Ducks Max in the 20s, um, Rabbits, what's that, like 6? Uh, they can be... How did that hit way back there? Excuse me. Is he here for 150? That was odd. Do your dance. Kind of intestine shot, that was rough. Anyway. You can deal with a less special, you know, rabbit or whatever, and just get a really high scoring elk and moose and all that, and you'd be fine. Top session score and just wipe out everything on the map would be interesting. Rooster, thank you so much for the super chat, by the way. Huge fan and love the videos. Well, thank you. Uh, are you doing another whitetail grind? I'm going to do one when they fix the fur type glitch. So if you're unaware, Pretty much rare whitetail and coyote in the trophy lodge. Just watch that big old four spawn in. Um, they are currently displaying as common. 
and it sounds like they're going to be able to fix that, but that fix is potentially going to change the fur types of new kills since the update. So for instance, let's say I were to do a grind now before they fix it and kill Melanistic Whitetail, which I really want. That Melanistic Whitetail may become a common when they fix it, and that there's not going to be a second fix with the fur types as far as I'm aware. So I want to wait. I want to, you know, make sure any rares or super rares or super great ones like that one guy got are going to remain that, and then I'll do the grind. It's 5 p.m. where the time go? I don't know. I'm trying to get around here to where I can claim these. I think it's best to go this way, actually. Got a couple of things. By the way, despite the fact that we did kill two diamond turkeys, I don't... What you growl at? Hi. I don't think we're going to do a trip to the trophy lodge today just because they're kind of normal boyos. No diamond rabbits unless one of these is a three. It's a male. Ah. I try so hard, and I would swear I do it sometimes when I'm not on stream, but I try to make those shots where I like lead them not knowing the distance. It's fun when they hit anyway. Okay, there's a couple more. Yeah, no three. So what I was going to say still stands. No diamond rabbits, unfortunately. But can hope for progress towards one in the future at some point. I can't even hit it. Hey, yep. All right. That's not going to be a respawn, but it's fine. Thanks for the help, autocorrect. Autocorrect is there to be... Man, with the opportunity to kill both of these, I think we will. Anyway, autocorrect is there to be helpful and never hurtful. Definitely. I was aware, uh, you guys may have seen the video with Kyla's Diamond Coyote. In that video was a troll level 5 Bighorn, and there were three max weight Bighorn running around here. The two fours that we just killed, and the level 5 that trolled Kyla, so at least we've now killed all those and can get response. Gonna make it happen, Kyla? Second Extinction Streams? I think it'll be good times. I like it. The OG animal should be fine. Yes. Too much of a 12 to commit to the ground. It's fun to do and it's rewarding to do, but it certainly can be a time-consuming, life-consuming kind of deal. I mean, for the 45 days that I did it, and Rancho is definitely easier. The number of kills that I'm seeing people get on Rancho is just insane, like per day. Uh, what's the average? 45 days, 1,600 kills. It's well under 100 a day. Around 50 a day. I'm surprised it's that low. I felt like I was doing more, but I guess I was still doing like one video per day and all that stuff in there too. Anyway, uh... There were many days where it felt like that was all I was doing was working on that grad. Second extinction is scary. It can be if you play without your volume on. Getting jumped by a a uh, flatback as they call them and and Kylosaurus I think is the tactical name. I make sure to say that just because Kylo. Uh, isn't this big bigger than the troll? I think it is. Anyway, uh, they're they're kind of rude and scary. Kyla not with you at the moment? Unfortunately not. Back in Georgia for the moment. Hopefully here, depending on exactly how things go, um, <laughs> the nearness of this could change, but hopefully in the next couple of weeks I can take a trip down there and hang out for a little while. Messed up that, but that's fine. Uh, the best thank you for the super chat again. You know you can go through the middle? Like where I am now? I think I went through the middle. Did I go through the middle? I think I knew that. I'm not sure if I went the right way. I had to go get those bighorn anyway, so I sort of forgot where I was. Is my OG diamond albino mule deer going to be fine? Uh, OG animals should be fine, yes. It may display as a common for now. I don't know. My melanistic mule deer displays as a melanistic, so I'm not even sure they got affected. I think it's just whitetail and coyotes. Anyway. We are officially going to be wrapping up here. A couple of diamond turkeys. Figures we kill several diamond level 3 animals. They are just not rabbits. But like I said, hopefully progress with the number of rabbits we killed. And 
I'm still optimistic that we can manage to get one here in the next couple of days and have a diamond of everything in the game again, but we shall see. Anyway, as always, thank you guys for watching, thanks for hanging out, thanks for all the support, and I will see you in tomorrow's video. Bye!